Hey Scrappy friends, welcome back. This is Helen here for the Hey Little Magpie creative team. I am doing a three colour seal today. I'm doing a thistle for my Scotland album. Um, I abandoned this one. So I've done the green, scraped it off, reheated my palette knife, done the purple, scraped it off. Um, didn't go so well. So I moved on to doing it this way where I heat the stamp and the palette knife up. I um, do the purple scrape it, green scrape it, and then like before it's cooled down so that it's um, all scrapes off a lot cleaner. I give it a bit of a clean up with a piece of kitchen roll as well whilst I'm waiting for the white to melt. And then stamp it in the white and it went so much better. Um, so this is the layout. This is a picture of Mr Ding as we got to Scotland in May with my sister and brother-in-law. Um, he just nipped to buy some sun cream and put a little bit too much on his face. Um, so yeah, we are up in the restaurant at the camp and uh, sat outside in lovely sunshine under an umbrella because I can't sit directly in the sun it makes me feel ill um and we are yeah Mr Ding's just uh <laughs> enjoying putting a little bit too much uh sun cream on I am using good vibrations by, by pretty little studio um Sarah has got a few other collections now in from pretty little studio in the Halo Magpie shop so please check them out that black card border I've used there that is the latest of the Halo Little Magpie border dies so there's that thick scallop and then this gorgeous loopy scallop one as well. Um, so that's the latest of those. And I'm just going through the other Hey Little Magpie dies to pull out a few bits to add to this page. So I'm using that line that notebook so it embosses lines onto the card. Um, I So I didn't have any scrap card with me. I'm, at a, I'm doing this at a crop, which is why I've got my old purple mat out. Um, and I didn't have any scrap card with me. So where the six by six piece of pattern paper is going as a map where the photo is, I am gutting a four inch square out of the back of the paper to cut the other bit, bits of die cut in one and you can see the pattern paper covers it. So um, I use that piece of white for the notebook die and then I am going to cut from piece of pattern paper the viewfinder reels and I also, um, oh, I stamped something in a little bit. I'll show you that in a little bit. So, yeah, as I said, I'm using the Good Vibrations for Pretty Little Studio. I've got a strip of the hearts there from the 12 by 12 papers. And then a couple of scraps from the 6 by 6 papers. And then a full 6 by 6 paper piece that's um, under that as well. I'm using a couple of seals. So I'm using the best of the three seals I did with the thistle. Um, it is the one that turned out the best. That's the one, the last one I did where I poured the purple and the green on before the stamp cooled down and scraped them off separately. Um, that worked out the best. It come out the cleanest. Um, so I, I have just got my brayer there with some, I can't remember if it's squeezed lemonade or fossilised amber. You'll be able to see that better on the screen. I think it might be fossilised amber. Um, and I've just brayed that on in the patches under where my photo mat's going to be and where that viewfinder die in the top left is going. And now I'm just layering everything back on, just sticking it down with that ATG. Um, sticks to refill in there. Somebody asked me at the crop where I got my refills for the ATG from. So I just want to mention that it's for, actually from Halo Magpie as well. Um, it sticks to refills that, cut, that fit this ATG gun. And they're nice and long and really quite inexpensive. Um, so, yeah, if you find a die there up in the top left, and that's going to be a base for one of the wax seals. And then I'm using another one in the bottom right that's going to mat the uh, notepad piece on for my journaling and uh, again you know another base uh, an anchor point for one of the wax seals as well the other wax seal i'm using is the geotag stamp the uh, halo magpie exclusive designed uh, geotag wax stamp seal that i uh, i sat and did a, a batch stamping session not so long ago and that's one of those so yeah, just layering it all up now and I popped some 3D foam behind the photo mat, just masked it on a piece of scrap black I've got with me. Um, I actually bought a 
piece of 12 by 12 black <laughs> from Sarah whilst I was there and that's what all that die cutting and scraps are from. Um, okay, so this is another one of the new dies. These are stamps and dies that Sarah's designed. So this is Happiest. I am going to stamp it in black memento. And ordinarily when I am stamping a new photopolymer stamp, I will give it a rub over with a, a white rubber, a white eraser, and then clean that with a, uh, just like a baby wipe or chamois or something, um, just to clean the stamp off, get any residue off, clean, clean it off, and it also gives it a little bit of purchase as well for the ink. So this hasn't stamped as clear as when I did the snapshot on a layout not so long ago, because I haven't prepared the stamp first of all. Um, it, it's a brand new stamp that I bought, that I, you know, I just bought and I didn't have my rubber with me to prepare it how I normally prepare it. Um, I'm doing happiest holiday for this and then I'm going to add the journaling to that white piece at the bottom. Um, link is going to be in the description for the Halo My Pie shop where you can pick, still pick up Good Vibration and the wax seal um, supplies that I have used here for this layout and the dies etc dies and stamps from Sarah and there's you know some distress in there as well so I will link to the shop and uh, don't forget to check out the rest of the guys on the channel like and subscribe to our videos it really does help promote the channel and let other people see what we are making hit the notification bell when you know so you know one one of us has posted a video again that is it add a couple of word stickers and i am done thanks so much for watching have a great day take care bye, -bye. <music>